Hey guys, what's happening? This is Toasty bringing you guys a Pokemon OU match on Pokemon Online. Well, sorry, it's OU against Pro Hacks. And I must say, for Christmas, I feel like I got really spoiled. I actually got Stilettos, which is really scary. I'm really klutzy. I'm Nook. Yeah, I just got a whole bunch of stuff. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Maybe I'll ramble on about it in this battle. Anyways, I'm playing with my gravity team again, and I sent out Jirachi, and I am definitely fearing this Heedran, and I knew I could outspeed it, so I went for the U-turn just to break its balloon, now that I have anything that's Earthquake, but whatever. And Vaporeon would have been able to take that hit rather nicely, because the special defense isn't too bad, but it did hit me with a crit, so I decided to roar out whatever he was going to send in. You know, I can take on a Hydreigon easily, but I see it has Charge Beam. I had never seen the set the Hydreigon, and I was really curious. So here, I just went for a skull just to kind of see what it would do. I was hoping to scare it out, seeing for a switch. And here, I do go for a wish, because I thought that, you know, the charge beam would start building up. And here, I am planning to try to heal up my Vaporeon up until the point. And my dog is trying to eat food in my bedroom. Jack. I'm sorry. Anyway, I do send out Jeff too, and you can see most of my pokes have really lame names. So, if you guys can leave in the comments below with some really cool names, that would be great. And he does go for a Dark Pulse, it does a lot. And it does finish off my Jeff, but I do get the gravity off, so I feel very confident to send out Starmie and have him do a Blizzard to take out the Hydreigon. And that's one threat down on my team. Yes, I did lose one of my special but it's not too bad. And here I went for the thunder. Ho I was just wanting to get the para hacks, hopefully, and I did get it. 30% chance. Go toasty, go. <laughs> I gotta get lucky once in a while. And he does get paralyzed again, so gravity did go back to normal. And here I just went for a thunder. I was like, I gotta finish this thing off. I'm not risking going for gravity. And 70% accuracy. It does hit. I got really lucky in this battle. But you guys, you know, here you can actually see how my team works. But I was expecting a uh, will o of some sort, and I did. I do realize that this is actually his Zorark. And in the beginning it glitched, I know, just ignore it. But anyways, Gengar is going to be faster, it's going to take it off, and I love Gengar, he has these little cute hands and stuff. And it reminds me, I was looking at Pokemon dolls, because Nick actually bought me two of them. He bought me Entei and Zorora. Those are like some of my two, well... They're probably in my top two favorite Pokemon, and I'm really happy, and I hope I get more. Anyways, I do hit him with a Hypnosis since it's 100% accuracy. No, I think it's 95. Yeah, it's like 95, 90 because of the gravity effects. And here I do go for the Shadow Ball, and the first time I hit Hypnosis, it didn't work because he had Lumberry, but fortunately I hit him a second time. And I do take out his, uh, what is it called, Dragonite, his Dirt Knight, without any problems. And here, I forget that, um, what is it? I forget all these Pokemon names. Heatran actually does have really good special defense, and Gengar is not able to take him out. But here, he goes for an explosion, and Vaporeon is my physical wall, so she takes that like a beast since, um, fortunately, explosion was nerfed in this gen. But here, he does go for a Confuse Ray, and I'm like, ugh. Hopefully my luck stays in this game, but... I thought he had another Pokemon, so I was just going to roar him out while I wish, and you know, healed up for my wish. But, me being the derp I am, I completely forgot that it was his last Pokemon. And here I'm going for a Scald, hopefully, hoping for the Burn Hex, because it is a special, um, not a special attacker, it's a regular attacker. You guys can tell I haven't narrated a battle in a while. But here he sets up sub, and I'm not really too worried because I am faster than him, and... I can kill him off without rather ease if I don't get Parahex, and I could switch out to another Pokemon, but I really want to take him down with my Vaporeon. I'm not quite sure why, I just really, really like Vaporeon, so... You know, if I didn't use Slowbro on my original teams, I would... Well, back in the day, I would use, actually, Vaporeon, and I hope to get a Pokemon doll with her soon, but... Anyways, he just keeps going for the Thunder Punches, and I get... Confused, of course, and I hit myself in confusion, but here I do get to protect off, and I'm just trying to get some leftover recoveries here because I need all I can get. I mean, I'm in a rather comfortable position in this battle right now, but 
I still don't feel too comfortable with um letting my Vaporeon die. I really want to finish it off with Vaporeon. And I can tell I didn't mute my speakers so you guys can hear my keyboard typing. Just like I failed in my last video to hide my mouse. But that's okay, you know. You guys just pretend that you don't hear the typing and just listen to my beautiful voice. Anyways, I do get the wish off. I go for the protect and I did not get one single burn with my scald. I had really good luck with my thunders and stuff. My starmie must have been lucky because it's obviously a star. But... My skulls were not, you know, burning, and it was rather annoying. And here he gets the pair of hacks. I have a 30% chance of burning him, and he has a, what, 10% chance of par paralyzing me? But yeah. Anyways, I am confused, I am paralyzed, but I do manage to get the skull. I get probably an unnecessary crit, but, you know, good game, Pro Hacks. Thank you very, 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 very much for playing, and he was rather fun. And like, comment, subscribe, add to your favorites. Please tell your friends because I would appreciate it very much. And, you know, I guess my question of the day is, what Let's Play would you like to see me play? Alright, folks. Why did I call you folks? Anyways, peace out, broskies. Until next time.